ओके स्टूडेंट सो नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एक्सरसाइज 3.7 क्वेश्चन नंबर टू सो क्वेश्चन नंबर टू से इज वॉट इज द एच सी एफ ऑफ टू कंजेक्यूटिव नंबर्स एंड देन बी पार्ट इज एच सी एफ ऑफ टू कंजेक्यूटिव इवन नंबर्स एंड सी पार्ट इज कंजेक्यूटिव ऑड नंबर्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ए पार्ट एच सी एफ ऑफ टू कंजेक्यूटिव नंबर्स इज ऑलवेज वन यू कैन टेक एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ एच सी एफ ऑफ टू एंड थ्री so what is hcf of 2 and 3 it is 1 you can take any example you can take any two consecutive numbers and check what is the hcf hcf will always be 1 now b part says what is hcf of two consecutive even numbers so we have taken example of 2 and 4 2 and 4 are two consecutive even numbers right so what is hcf of 2 and 4 it is 2 so you can check with any two consecutive even numbers hcf will always be 2 now i leave it on you only take more and more examples and check it out okay now next is uh c part what is the hcf of two consecutive odd numbers so hcf of we have taken two consecutive odd numbers 3 and 5 so what is hcf of two consecutive odd numbers it is one always so you can check it by taking other consecutive odd numbers also okay now next is question number 3 that hcf of two co prime numbers is 4 and 15 was found as follows we have done the prime factorization of 4 which is 2 into 2 and 15 can be written as 3 multiplied by 5 so it says since there is no common prime factor so hcf of 4 and 15 is 0 is the answer correct if not then what is the correct hcf so students in when we have started taking the common factors we have done that 1 is the common factor okay we have done that factor 1 is factor of every number right so One is the common factor of all the numbers. You can take any two numbers. One is always the factor. One is always the common factor, right? So if two numbers are not having any other prime factor, one is always there. So if HCF of four and fifteen will not be equal to zero, it will be equal to one. Thank you.